Hello anyone who may be watching now, later on YouTube, Helen here, along with... Drakir! And stupid lamp comes on, I forgot that again. And yeah, welcome back to the 8th side, Saturday Side Show, where we'll be continuing on with Gunpoint. Yay! Uh, oh, before I forget, I noticed something about the, the streams of late. Yeah? What happened to the curse? Uh, I've been preparing better. That's probably it. <laughs> yeah, I, I say that even though I forgot to turn this dumb thing on this time, so it might be returning after all. Wait, what did you forgot to turn on this time? Uh, the, la the, la the light that shines on my face, so it's not just the uh, light from the screen. So from what I've seen, it hasn't really been helping that much with that. Yeah, but oh well. That's not a, that's not a biggie. <laughs> yeah. Okay, where to go? Last time we played this game, when we started, we uh, accidentally threw ourselves out of a window. <laughs> uh, then, we, then someone across the street was murdered, and we were... You know, Basically, we were going to get framed for it if we didn't erase the data, or erase the footage, which was saved in five separate you know, other areas as well. And yeah, so we went around erasing that, and then someone else got framed for the murder, uh, who now should be free because of, ev uh, of evidence that uh, we uh, discovered when we were invest when we infiltrated the morgue. And proved that the <coughs> proved that the autopsy report, that's the word I was looking for, had been forged. Or at least had been edited afterwards to well fit their quote unquote evidence. Like uh, yeah. So we have the Rook over here is the CEO of the company of the that the victim was you know, belonged to or worked for. Uh, she's been working on something, apparently, and we've helped her opponents find out a little bit of data about that. Uh, but we've also been helping the chief of police here uh, with, well, all of that what I previously described. And he now has a suspect. So, and, well, he pays better. So let's check here. We have already have that charged up. Uh, let's just ma max that out. Is there anything we can... <laughs> Frank's pants my... Let's see. Really wire enemy guns. Sometimes in kind of... Land sign leaf on any height. Let's get that. Uh, the gate crashes. 8,000 to down... <laughs> Come on. We're just... Why? Yeah, probably because it would make things too easy. Because half of the game is just getting doors unlocked so you can pass through. True, though I imagine it would be hard to crush a metal door. <clears throat> I think I've got something. Uh, what? That post-mortem you retrieved so that Selena was shot again, point blank, with the same weapon right after hitting the ground, which suggests a killer threw himself out of a third-story window just to make sure she was dead. <laughs> Can't fault him for enthusiasm. The people who throw themselves out of third-story windows aren't all bad, uh, because this idiot did that. <laughs> that means he had tech. I'm guessing a dropshot trench coat, but who knows what else. So we tracked some shipments from TX Fabrications who make that stuff, and it turned out an ad uh, up. it turned up an address right across the street from the crime scene. Oh, cool. <laughs> I want you to check it out, look for any evidence of what kit my, this guy might have, and anything else suspicious. Up for it? Always. <laughs> so basically, we've accidentally incriminated ourselves yet again. Okay, there we are in the corner. 
at this rate, you definitely be at least a chance for uh, hitting a lot of people. Do, I don't think you yeah. killed anyone so far. Or... Uh, one on accident. <laughs> okay, we're going what to. What the heck is going on? Oh, I see. This guy is walking past the set. A motion detector, so we can use that to close the door, and then rewire it through the light there, so that is closed off. <laughs> and we still get shots. Uh, yeah. What the heck? Uh, whatever you want to say about these cops, they are at least <laughs> crack shots, and good at cracking my skull. Wait, hold on. Ain't a crack shot an insult? It's a good shot. I think. Yep. I was put on an insult. Maybe I, uh, maybe I misunderstood when uh, people use the term crack shot. And <laughs> we get killed again. Okay, I'm just... we, got we got spotted there. Let's do a bigger. Okay, all of those are now out. Let's just let's just turn off the lights. That'll help us a bunch. Even this guy can still see us if we're in the lights from this window, or just like that. I'm guessing. Oh, yeah, he, he had us lined the fuck up. I just had a. I don't know if there's a mod for the game, but I think I just had a brilliant mod idea for the game. And that would be? Uh, what was the name again? Suko? Or the, the frog girl from Hero Academia. Uh, yeah, Sue. Or Asue. Yeah, it seems like she would probably fit in here quite well. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, can I say? Yeah. What was that? Yeah. Like, I was saying, she is kind of inquisitive. True. Now let's see. Are there, I see. I see a laptop over there. Well, I wonder what the heck that was. There you go. Bloody fly. That was what the disturb me to my life, but okay, I'm down fly. Oh, I. Motion sensor or something or what is that? Oh, well, whatever it is, it's not activated to, to anything now. From okay, Delgado to Mark Jackson, Lurk. Melanie knew you were here yesterday. Hopefully, she thinks it's just business, but. Uh, I hate doing this to her. I don't think she knows anything, but then I wouldn't. She's about eight times smarter than me. Whatever it was you wanted to talk about tonight, I hope it has to do with you manning the hell up and telling her. That sounds suspicious. Then again... Uh, what? Uh, the heck? How did... What happened there? Good question, and I think we did learn the last time that the, 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 the hospital will have an affair with a murdered victim. Is this not the murdered victim did not like to be in the affair? <laughs> the motherfucker shot us straight out of the air. <sighs> uh, yeah, she was go she was cheating. He, no, he was cheating with her, so I'm guessing. She yeah, on the one hand, this reads like she was getting her whacked. On the other, what is setting you off? On the other, yeah, it could just mean that she meant to fire her. Okay. Oh, he's autumn. He's. Did he hear? The... I think he heard the window break. Anything else here? I don't see any laptops. So we can just exit. Let's see. 
found anything. Um, <laughs> yep, packaging for bullfrog, projectile trousers, nope, this pla <laughs> the place was clean. The only thing this guy's guilty of is great taste. Damn, it might be a dummy address. I can't find any records of who rents it. I'll keep digging and let you know what turns up. Yeah, we've been we've been dancing back and forth between incriminating ourselves and <laughs> cleaning our own name. Uh. And so far, not getting anywhere closer to the. Uh, well, we have been getting somewhat closer to the re real culprit. Yeah, but in a complicated manner. Yeah, there was, uh, if I remember correctly, there, we found evidence that the rival company to Rooks here was blackmailing her, or was blackmailing her husband, probably about the affair. Um, and yeah, that same company now has us looking. F they, were, they were probably blackmailing him to try and find information on that prototype that Rook is speaking of. Hmm. Uh, for now, let's continue on with the room. So I, I don't get why the how that look. I don't know how that might uh, connect back to assassinating. Uh, yeah, the victim. I've got something big. I think we can close this case tonight. Drop me a line, and I'll tell you what I can do. Except, the source I trust has tipped me. The trust has tipped me off to a recording of everything that happened in Rook's office the night of Delgado's murder. It's from a second camera. And one that was backed up to a secure data sec facility without the killer knowing I need you to break into data sec and get that recording for me. Okay. Uh, does that mean the, the entire office building or just the office office? If that means the office where the actual murder happened, that would be helpful for us. Yeah, where's the second where was the second camera? I can't tell you that yet. Okay, who's the source? I can't tell you that yet. Why do you believe them? I can't <laughs> Well thanks for the information, you've been a big help. Okay. Wait, well, is he suspecting you? I'm getting the feeling that he might. Uh, let's see, we can... Okay, we need to get to that. Yeah. Let's jack into this. And... Have... Okay, we can disconnect that. And... Hmm. Call that. Okay, let's see what that activates. That is connected to something, and... It does nothing. That's the, our objective, though. Hmm. Oh, we can also tap into that, of course. Oh, we can use that to connect that. Uh, wait. Uh, connect that to that, because we need to set off the motion detector, or the sound detector. And we do that by calling the... <coughs> by calling the elevator up again. So hack this. And then we get out. I see a laptop. Hmm. But would it be annoying if, if you want a good ending, if there is uh, several endings, that you need all the laptops? I don't think this game goes that way. Hmm. Okay, this might be a bit tricky because this is a temporary. We'd have to rush in and out for this. Because the moment that that uh, sound detect no wait all the way around. The moment that the sound detector or is that going? Oh no, this is a normal door, that'll stay open. Okay, so just get in, go up. I was overthinking there. Go, go down. Disconnect that, just to be sure. And there we go. Tie the 
lava lava beating set up all right i'm lost now why do the east point police want to store something on the server in particular and what is it I, if it was a feed wouldn't we just receive a stream like usual yes i'm no i'm not stealing footage of people making out for you hey. That back to that, and up we go. There we go. And we're out. And we almost fell back in. That would be a sight to behold. <laughs> so, did you find the file? Yep, here it is. I'll be honest, this is just a dummy file I put there. You match everything we know about Selena's killer, so we had to test whether you were, you know, where your alliances lay. I apologize for the distrust, I'm sure you understand. Yeah, because we've been sending them quite... We sent him quite a bit of, well, bullshit data. And, uh... <laughs> no, I kind of lost the plot on mission two. I just like getting paid. Well, <laughs> Oh, hello here. Well, you were close. I did wipe the data sack footage, but I didn't kill Delgado. Now, let's be a bit daring. Yeah, but he, he wants to uncorrupt the police. What? You've been helping me investigate yourself? <laughs> what can I say? You pay well. <laughs> <laughs> so you wiped the footage because it made you look guilty. Do you... you did you see you know, who actually did it? Uh, no, but I suspect it was someone working for Intax. Jesus, all right. Well, you've helped me uh, get to the bottom of my corruption problem, at least. Turns out men when we are just lazy idiots. That's gonna make it hard to make progress on the Delgado case for a while. So if you find the guy who did it before I do, just send me a text on your way there. If we get reports of gunshots or anything, we might be a bit slow to respond. We might not solve that case. Okay, so he owes us one. He did react to quite well. Yeah. I think when I originally played this, because I have played through this game before, I'm not sure if I said that in the previous time we were playing this. I think, let me double check, I got an achievement, I think, for basically leading this guy around by his nose or something. <laughs> uh, let's see, where is this one? I th I'm pretty sure it was one of these here. Uh, not that. No. Hmm. Okay, I... I thought something. I thought I saw uh, something pop up with an achievement back then, but basically, I think it was for just completely wiping out all evidence of uh, our connection with that. But yeah, that has ended that plotline. So now let's finally go look what what Rook has to say. She's probably been <laughs> waiting like a week by now. I think actually this. All I, th I think this actually takes place in a single night. And yeah, we can replay missions. Okay, interesting. Just up the bullfrog more. Let's see, so yeah, he, basically he was lying at the, the previous mission, or the one before that, that he didn't, didn't, you know, that he didn't know who... <clears throat> that he didn't know who the apartment was, uh, was rented by. Uh, let's see. Let's get uh, this one. Long shot. We wire enemy guns. Go, yeah, we could get the. We could have gotten the resolver as well. We actually we could still get it by handing something in. But uh, yeah, I'm I'm going more for just stealth than uh, just killing or actually intimidating. If if you watch the trailer for this game at. At the end, it actually shows that if you have your gun out on a, an enforce, on a cop, or a guard, better word, uh, then they won't shoot, and they will slowly back away if you approach them. But if you corner them, of course, they're probably going to shoot. And I'm not going to experiment that with, with that just yet. <laughs> Conway, get in touch. There is something you should know about your intact contracts. 
I know he's taking a job to steal one of my prototypes. Honestly, it was the only thing going. <laughs> yeah. It's fine, you're freelance. You're under no obligation to my company. I'm contacting you because the job was a ruse. The prototype you're looking for doesn't exist. We've left the lethal weapons market completely. Um, your guards have said something pretty differently in the <laughs> in the past when they shot me out of freaking air. Yeah, actually, those <laughs> were the cops. Well, that's gonna make my mission to retrieve it trickier. Maybe not. I'd actually like Intex to steal something from us, something with a tracker on it. I'd be interested to know where it ends up. Okay, smart. A fake project and to have it uh, fake stolen to, well, see what the hell they are, uh, are up to or where they stash their uh, nefariously gained goods. Nefariously gained goods, that's a new one for me, I think. <laughs> Okay. Maybe not. Uh, da, 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 we've already said it. Wire is telling me. We honestly don't have one. We don't have anything you could steal that would be convincing to Gessler as a prototype weapon. So, I need you to steal one. Uh, so that I can give it to you so that I can steal it from you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, I love this job. <laughs> <laughs> uh, aren't you afraid I'll tell Gessler? No, go ahead. It'll sound exactly like a ruse to cover up our secret project. From who? The same fabrication company that make our prototypes. They build them for other clients too, and I want you to steal something they're making for the automotive industry. It won't look like a weapon, but ink tanks won't, won't know what it is. That means it'll get to their labs, and we can track it there, trace it there. Well, that also makes perfect sense. Where am I going? 39 London Road. Special requests. I'd appreciate it if you could keep violence to a minimum. <laughs> yeah, cut through the trailer <laughs> where that very same line pops up, and Conway stops punching, and then punch. Okay, here we go. Now let's have a look. Oh, hello. Three over there. Uh, can we... Can, mm. Okay, we can open that up. But otherwise we have no entrance yet, at least. Those two are too out of sync to get one of them bapped by the door. <laughs> Actually, I should unload it. Okay, unconnect it. Disconnect those two, then I let that guy go in there. Go. Oh, I'm being dumb. Now we have full access. Okay, that'll lock that guy inside. And the heck is that? Oh, that's just the light. <laughs> so now we connect that to that, so this door will open. And okay, this is basically just like a, a marble game or something. We have to move. No, he got out. I should have disconnected that again. one and yeah as you can see we can now trigger uh, we can now uh, have something to trigger to the guns as well disconnect that connect uh, hmm, that hmm. oh wait the 
we'll turn the lights off, which draws him out. That'll open. That can turn off the light over there. And then open up the door for me. Okay, that was... Oh, <laughs> the cop up top, or the guard up top got me there. Okay, that missed the upper, that missed us on the window. Uh, actually, no, he's still walking around. Okay, that's good for us. <laughs> but that was less good. How about a bit of rock do you have for today? Should have locked him in the door there. Okay, just quickly grab that, grab it, and then we can just hide on the ceiling while he's busy picking his nose in there. Uh, hmm. Okay, we can connect both of those to that. Okay. Cling to the ceiling for a bit. And <laughs> dead we are. Okay. That just missed it. Okay, but he's coming back downstairs there. And there we go. And done. Where's the laptop? Okay, find it okay? What the hell is this? Some kind of electronic accelerator my R&D guys looked into uh, something a bit like it from projectiles once. Dropping it at the trash can at Union, I'll have someone pick it up, plant the tracker and move it into UTX building. Okay, simple enough. Ah, Gessler, ready? It's time. Okay, you ought to know where, where you're going, but I'll say it anyway. TX Fabrication, Dial Street, Steel Rocks Prototype. It, and that's it. He doesn't even take any back talk. As in life, anyone in a black suit is a professional. Professionals will see it even if at gunpoint. And they can also see in the dark. Why not? There's one of those professionals. And there's the prototype. Under guard by an enforcer. And there's the open room. Uh, no, no, there's a door between us. From <laughs> what I thought it, we was I was going to get shot there. Uh, See a laptop over there. Let's see. Let's turn that off. Actually, we need, to, we need to get in there because there's one of the riders. Um, and this really necessary? We, we already stole it, so we're gonna steal it again? Well, he needs to be. We need to convince Gessler that it, we actually stole it, and if we just hand it in without anything actually happening, he'd get suspicious. So let's open that up. I guess, but still. It's not like he knows anything happens here. I think. This guy can see in the dark, so we need to stay out of his sight. Check in. And we check out. Okay. Uh, alarm is disabled. Do we have we have no switches, only this camera here. Okay. There's the green wire.
connect that to that. And that'll actually be most of that. The green one will only be for the laptop. But we want the laptop. Because, well, the information. Okay. Disconnect that. Oh, but... Uh, okay, when did you turn around? But who shot you? This guy over here who was looking the other way before. Okay. When the hell did you turn around? Actually, that solves that. There. Well, he still turn around. So. Yeah, but we can get out through the door over here. Or here. So we might as well take care of that right now. He's not actually going outside, okay. Should be able to. Okay, so. I'm yeah, pretty sure that you should be able to link two guns. Uh, why not now, for some reason? Okay, well, at least let's grab this accelerator. And then up to steam? It's an enforcer. We can't pin this guy down. Not Seeing a laptop on this map is hard. Yeah, they are a bit small. And well, it, it looks. It pretty much looks like someone forgot a laptop in the printer room. Okay. Oh, well, that doesn't work. I thought we could just run up, run down, and when he chases us, we just cling to the ceiling. Um, actually... Hmm. Okay, let's close that up again. And I'm thinking we can go downstairs, go up and around. And no. Up. That was my fault. Hmm. I, think, I think my sound just failed. Yep, it did. I, I do not get why that happens from time to time. It just seems to happen at complete random. Probably lock that guy in there. Let's keep that just in case. And yeah, I'm thinking we can just go around. We'll have to knock this guy out. Which will mean that we'll have a witness. Or we accidentally kill him by knocking him off the roof. Wait. I, th I thought we bought the thing that made it made breaking glass silent. Oh, and now he's just freaking the hell out. Can we do that without killing him? Yeah, well, we'd probably have to jump him from the other side, so let's just get ourselves killed again. And I mean, that time you didn't spot us, but he's still looking the wrong way. It... <laughs> how, did we... how did you miss the first shot there, dumbass? <laughs> oh, and now our auto safe is too far back to actually get killed. I think it's a bit too much work to restart the whole mission. 
Oh, that, that one that went back far enough. Uh, let's Ooh. jump over there. Okay, now he's out. But seriously, why? The breaking the window should be silent. Still going to just look the same. Wait, the I same. think I know why. Yep, there we go. You're breaking the window in the same room as him. Yep, I, I think we got the upgrade that made it, but the, the breaking windows completely silent. But oh well. Let, let's just open this door up and go grab, go grab the laptop. As soon as Mr. Man in Black is back. Well, there's another thing you uh, don't think you realized about breaking windows. Glass. Yeah, that then. Um, if you bro break a window silently, there's something called temperature. And Basically, he feels a draft up his ass. Yeah. <laughs> and maybe start to realize that that sort of rain is very lot. Oh. Why is the hole in the window? Actually, no, and why is there a man with rope legs? We still need to figure something to open that up. It's probably best to just go with this one. No extra shenanigans. Uh, now we just wait for this guy to pass by. Oh. Okay, so if the elevator arrives, it also sets off the, uh, the summon thing. <laughs> okay, that's good to know. Ackland to wait to Gessler. Wait it. Agent four knocked on consoles when one of my techs wired the front door to open in his face. Agent five fell down with six to shaft in our drop shot testing grounds. Agent six shot. We, we just shot him for it. Agent seven gate crasher test shots and kicked the door into him. You get it yet? I've known Melanie Rook longer than you, so I hope you'll take some advice. If you think you know her next move, you're looking at the wrong game. Kelly Eklund. Okay, what? you then, Kelly. Basically, previous infiltrators. Infiltration attempts. <laughs> or was that her... Was that her basically talking, you know, saying, just try trying to spy on us, we're going to get it anyways. <laughs> no, you're not going to get anything anyways. Get it? Uh, yep. Fucking Fantastico, get off you know, the central switchbacks with the guy on the far bench, the cast is in his. I'll, I'll give him credit that he's to the freaking point. <laughs> okay. Got a trace. Let's see where it takes us. The track is operational. It's in the building we didn't know belonged to Intex. So if this is real, it could be big. What am I doing there? Pardon? Get the prototype back so they don't have time to realize it's fake and take anything else in that room that looks interesting. It's likely to be with their most sensitive stuff. Got it? And that's that. Okay. Oh, hello there. Starting off with this motion sensor door. And uh, just too late. Okay, disconnect that, connect to that. And that was bad timing. Yeah, it looks like it. Okay. Disconnect again. There we go. Now we can jack in here. 
here. Oh, I did. I didn't mean to go. I didn't mean to aim for that one. Okay. So blue doors. Uh, I actually didn't do much here. Okay. We have a light there that we can turn off. But this door is locked. It's closed. We can't get in there. And this guy has a. This button has a card in front of it. What else do we do? Go down. This guy's probably going to turn around at hearing the ding. Yes, he is. Is this camera connected to anything? Almost. Yeah, I got spotted there. I just accidentally killed two of them at once. Uh, let's see here. You can turn off the lights, that will make him open the door. That doesn't help us much. So. Wait. Okay. How long has he been there? Is that one of the ones that we landed on? I'll, I'll need to look that back for what the hell happened there. For now, though. Open up. And there is... Oh, hello. I didn't even see if there was a laptop there. <laughs> From Gessler to Jansburg. Struggling. Fuck, Carl. Don't get your cock in a knot. We're in East Point because uh, it's the cheapest place to make guns. We moved here after gun ban because of that. Yeah, that's the cheapest time to make guns. Your job is to make a lot of guns. Leave phase two to our lobbyists and leave Rook to me. Smarter men than you have lost small fortunes waiting for her company to die. Okay. Well, I give, I give points to Rookie for gonna evolve and leave guns, gun making for something else. Let's see, that's not far enough back to undo whatever we did to him. And, oh yeah, there it is. I think he just heard us land. I... <laughs> okay, grab that again. Uh, yeah, we'll just have to actually know. If we trigger that camera now... Uh, he is going to see us, so we need to distract him. We actually, if we tie the door to that then... No, wait, it's going to call them. It's going to call the elevator, and that's going to make the chime. So we go back up. And while he is distracted, we uh, grab him and get shot. <laughs> Well done, Helian. Well done. Okay, I might have actually deadly soft locked us in this fate. What? Okay. Knock him out. Okay, didn't mean to do that. But we have an opportunity. Oh, like, oh, young pup, Jesus Christ. Okay, give me that. Give me that. Is there anything else to grab around here? Doesn't look like it, but we can check in here. And just open up the door. And out. Bye-bye. We'll just uh, keep the accidental dropkick dead to, <laughs> to ourselves. We got the fake prototype and something else. How do you want it? Great work. Same dead drop as last time. I'll have a man there shortly. 
Okay, Rook is getting serious. <laughs> Gessler, go fuck yourself. <laughs> Uh, he, well, he got fucked over, but he fully deserved it. Okay, this is Rook. I need your expertise. It's regarding my employee, Katie Collins. Okay. After recording you've been looking for, it's my phone call in which Jackson threatens to kill Selena if she talks. It would be enough to get uh, Katie uh, Collins released and my husband arrested. Wasn't she already released? Let's see, case notes. Uh... Katie Collins has been arrested for murder. Mark Jackson claiming he saw Collins there at night, which is fake. Overheard Jackson referring to an incriminating recording a company called Intex have of him. The recording was scrubbed from both Intex server and a Rook's machine that downloaded it. I can't give it to the police. I didn't obtain it legally, so it's inadmissible. That's what I, I need you. I want you to copy it onto the police service and leave a security hole for the press to find it there. Does that actually work? I don't know, it's never been done before, but the East Point police would probably rather claim they were sitting on vital evidence than admit they didn't know how it even got there. Smart. And you're okay with your husband getting arrested? He's gone dark. I can't believe he did it, and I don't know if he'll go down for it. But he did put Collins in this situation, so he can damn well take the fallout. Uh, yeah. Everything is pointing to him now at the moment. What does the evidence say exactly? Jackson, I mean it. If you say one word about this anywhere, you'll be dead before you leave the building. Well, she was... Actually, she wasn't dead before she left the building. She was dead after she landed and got shot again. No, that's oh, not a good day to say the, I think to say the night someone gets killed. Have you told Collins? She didn't react to that. No, and I'd appreciate it if you didn't either. She had trouble coping with the guilt if I bring her coffee. <laughs> I don't want her to know I'm risking my career for her. The terminal you need to plant it on is on the first floor of the evidence warehouse on Union. I'm sending you a script that'll make it vulnerable. Once it's active, I'll tip off a journalist friend. Okay. So, is that... In cross-link mode, you can disconnect the device by clicking on it. You can also undo the last change you made by pressing U. I cannot think of a certain thing to tell you at this point. Uh, okay, there it is. But it's under guard by an enforcer. Let's, let's disconnect that little alarm there. And that one. And we connect that to the door. Oh, and then we connect the door to the light. We disconnect the light switch. The light goes to the door. And that'll be that. And there we go. One chain reaction. And. Okay, I think he. <laughs> I think. He might have spotted us there because I heard the click noise. It was basically them pulling the hammer on the gun. I heard it there again for some reason. I didn't mean to grab my drink. Just to have some refill. Are you already getting yourself into trouble? I, I, I'll leave you for five seconds. Seriously. Oh. <laughs> I didn't unplug. I didn't unplug that alarm. Uh, there I am. There we go. That unlocks. Hmm. Let's see. How do I get there? Hmm. Okay. Maybe connect that back and just jump out of the way. Jump. If we connect the alarm to the door to the hand scanner, yeah. okay, that wasn't the. Okay, 
Okay, I don't know what happened there for a second. We, he shot at us when we fell off, but we landed on our feet. Hmm. Connect that to the light over there for a second. We'll turn that off. Hmm. Now, actually, I think I know something we could do there. Shoot me for a moment. <laughs> That was too late. Three seconds back. Okay. We connect the alarm to that, and then we connect the the light to the alarm, which will make this guy come running. And yeah, that from there we can take it because that once the alarm is goes off, it'll take a moment for the door to close. That time we can wait. I for okay, they didn't go exactly as planned, but at least we're in. <laughs> hmm. okay. Checking here for a moment. Unhook that alarm. And connect that to that. Oh, oh, wrong way around. There we go. And now we just follow in. There's a laptop over there. Wait, where? Over here by the elevator. So let's just quickly grab that. Okay, to Detective David Carrillo to Detective Sal Gudal. Theory. So I'm a jury. The defendant has no alibi, lives alone, and had access to all the security footage that was mysteriously erased from for the night of the crime. And a reputable local business owner will testify that she was the last person left alive with the victim. How much do I care that you know, she did it in a weird way? The Logado case is an easy closed cell. With your case lock, you need an easy close. Just take the win. What? Yeah, uh, based two detectives. There we go. Two detectives talking about how they can easily manipulate a jury into going for it or into a, a conviction it's Katie uh, I uploaded the data wait what I just got the call they found her in her cell the notes just uh, said she didn't want to be a burden she committed suicide well fuck This is Jackson. The recording you had of me is real, but it's not the whole story. Selena and I were having an affair, and I told her not to say anything. I was just trying to protect her. You had a weird way of wording it, jackass. From who? Intax. They blackmailed me to steal a large sum of money from work. I used their plan to take it. But I didn't get uh, it to Intex. I was going to use it to blow the country with uh, Selena. I was warning her to keep it that to herself because I knew if Intex found out, they'd have her killed. If I'd know they were tapping my phone, the irony is not fucking lost. Okay. So, okay, so Intex killed uh, Selena to basically. Uh, frame Jackson here for it uh, for well fucking them over with well hit them trying to fuck him over okay why did you even tell Selena she was a smart girl she wasn't going to run off with me without knowing where the money came from I knew she wouldn't be wild about sleeping from work but we didn't have much choice 
giving it uh, to Intex would be worse, and doing nothing meant Intex would go public with the affair. Okay, why didn't kill t Intex kill you too? Have to frame him. They need me to steal the money from Rook. We sometimes channel money through my form t uh, Dodge Tax, so for a day or two the money would be in my name. If I died during uh, before transmitting, uh, transferring it to Intex, the money would go straight back to Rook once he inherited my company. And cut to the chase. Pardon again. I don't know how Rock got hold of that recording, but I know why she edited it. I know uh, why she gave it to you. She knows about me and Selena, and she knows about the money. If I get arrested now, it defaults back to her. She's trying to frame me. So what do you want? The full recording. Public, online. It proves the one Rook leaked was doctored, and it proves that I didn't kill Selena. The terminal that recorded it locked the location of both phones at the time I was out of town minutes before the she died. The terminal is in Intex's uh, uh, op center on Harvey Street. If you can get in, you can upload the full recording from there. I'll post it as an official job so you know, I can pay you so clearly. Okay. Conway it Rook. Ignore Jackson. Uh, you don't even know what he said. Also, how do you know he contacted us? Did he say the recording you have of me is real, but it's not the whole story? <laughs> to be honest, I wasn't listening. Uh, yes. Intex is still bugging his phone and I've taken over their network. I know who killed Selena, I know exactly where he is now, and I know what will happen if that recording gets out. The killer will vanish forever. The only reason he hasn't disappeared already is that he knows Jackson's going down for it. As soon as the cops start looking for someone else, he's gone. Okay, can't we just get the real killer then lick the recording? You want to let an innocent man go down to catch a guilty one? Hmm, let's go with that. You could, if you knew where he was. I could, if I wanted that recording leaked. But if Jackson gets out, I lose everything. The money he took broke our agreement, but it wasn't illegal. I can't get it back unless he's convicted. Uh, you want to let an innocent man go down to catch a, a guilty one? So he isn't completely innocent. Not the word I would use. Jackson framed Katie Collins for Celine's murder, which led directly to her death. The fact that he also cheated on me and stole most of my capital just makes me less conflicted about destroying him. Okay, so we're not talking like money that they could miss, but basically everything. <laughs> Still, every marriage has its rough passage. It's the old cliche, a husband runs off with a younger woman who doesn't spend and her spare time thinking of less and less traceable ways to destroy people. Wife untraceably destroys him. <laughs> okay. But yeah, he is in the, well, he is directly responsible for Katie Collins' suicide. So technically that could be considered a murder because, well, he was framing her. I'm mean, holding that until we can secure Jackson's conviction. So we can get Jackson convicted. How? The terminal at Intex that uh, Jackson wants you to upload that recording from. I need you to get to it and wipe it instead. Jackson goes down for Selena's murder. I get my company back. And you can do what you like to the man who killed your client. It's an easy call. Hmm. Okay. okay, the truth or the killer. 8,000 on both. Let's see, as discussed, get to the terminal that recorded my phone call and upload the full thing publicly. The whole truth gets out, I get the hell out of this city and pay you enough money to take on Intex yourself. Or go buy a, leaf, a gold leaf press coat and retire. The killer, you know what to do. The recording stored at a, on a terminal at Intex Ops in the Eastmount River. Get in and wipe it. Jackson goes down for Selena's murder and I'll get uh, to you the real killer. So, I believe Rookie for Jackson is indeed done so much. That is horrible. Yeah, it, it would be trading one injustice for a justice, though it would also serve justice on him for what he has done. So, technically speaking, that would be a net positive. 
Uh, if we go after Jackson, then... Yeah. He gets the money. He goes free for something he didn't do. But he also goes free for what he cost. The killer gets away. And Rook's company collapses, probably. Yeah. And, and again, he did cheating. And the, the woman cheated, but uh, he was not happy about them cheating during the world affair. Like, she, I recall, Irina, really, she wanted them to tell Rook about it, but no, no. And then she gets killed and all that. So, yeah, I'm, I'm Team Rookie here. Uh, it's more sp it's more said rook, like the e is silent, I think oh. at least. So yeah, get fucked, Jackson. Yeah, he's far from innocent. If he's gonna frame others, correct. Especially a person who is yeah innocent. He got the from earlier, like. She hinted that uh, she would get the guilt, uh, feel uh, guilty if you ser uh, serve her coffee. This probably was a hint that uh, she is very fragile of mind or something. And yeah, referring to someone of that to uh, someone just to commit suicide in a cell, just no, no. Screw Jackson. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that I have to up upgrade that silence is glass breaking, so why did he hear that? I'm, I'm oh. always <laughs> you look at the upgrade and you I See, meant to lock him in, instead I knocked him out. You sure you didn't knock his head? Oh wait, put his head over there. I put the decapitated him. Sort of lock this path up for us now, but but we can just go around. Oh, hello! You're coming up. Uh, and he can open the doors for us. Uh, turn that off quickly. <laughs> Actually, that worked. That worked massively in our interest. jump through here okay I had, I had overlooked that this door we couldn't open anyways and what do you activate that door over there okay not going there then at least not without turning off the lights which are on a purple circuit You? Let's turn. Hmm. Oh no! We turn. Connect that to that, and that to that, and then we might as well connect all of the other doors to this, so they will all open at once. And turn out the lights. There we go. I just realized something. Yeah? His, Jackson's quest was called The Truth. And yeah. it, it feels fishy, just that name alone. Hmm. Yeah, you have to be careful when people are talking about these truths. Because, yeah, it might be just their version of the truth. Yeah, basically giving him just another red flag. go completely as planned but we can fix that in just a second Zoop. <laughs> okay. down and actually where is this oh there it is from Fritz Kretzler to Rook fuck congratulations you fucked me on the prototype thing guess what I'm fucking you back the money you put into your husband's company you're never getting that back I have him by the balls 
last work before running, running, ruining your life and your company. Uh, well, her last words are us. So he can get fucked as well. Because, yeah, if, if it wasn't Rook, it wasn't, you know, <clears throat> it wasn't Jackson, it, it was, yeah, it was Intex that w did the murdering. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. And now we can get out of here. I probably should have connected that to the door here earlier, but oh well, we're not speed running anyways. And just to be dicks. Fantastic. God, it's been a, f a shitty few days. Thank you for ending it. Okay, so it was a few days, not one night. You could thank me by telling me who killed Selena Delgado. Selena was killed by an agent code named Hightower on Gessler's order. Miss Gessler was blackmailing Jackson to steal from me, but Jackson was planning to run off with Selena and the money. Gessler would have killed them both, but the money was still in Jackson's name. In Jackson's name. He took away Jackson's reason, so he took away Jackson's reason to run. I have enough enemy evidence to put Gessler away. He knows that now. If you don't get him and Hightower tonight, they'll both be gone by the morning. I still have access to Intex and Comms Network. I've called Hightower to Intex HQ. So if Gessler wants to meet, I strongly recommend you bring a gun, even if you don't intend to fire it. <laughs> Thanks, I'm off to commit the homicide. <laughs> Good luck, Richard. You're not too bad, Melanie. <laughs> come and get, fucking get me. Okay, I'll come and fucking get you. I'll get you with the fucking door. And, uh, wait, wasn't there one of the drop shot land silently from any height? Harsh cracker, muffle breaking glass. Yeah. I had that, but why the hell wasn't it not working? Rook's most successful model, illegal since the gun ban. Okay, so Rook, Rook is uh, dirty dealing a bit. And still, she is better than Gessler. Better than, well, Jackson. What is that? You just made me imagine you attacking Kessler with a damn door. <laughs> uh, because I plan to. Let's see. With the door gate crashes, you can kick down any conventional door by running into it. Like that. So, get fucked. Oh. Okay. Oh, yeah, you did kill someone with a door. Not in the way I expected, but. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay, so we have a map that's higher than usual now. <laughs> Whoa. Let's see. We won't be able to kick down these uh, vault doors, though. We can't enter here because the you know, professional is looking there. We can, however, get in through here. Knock, knock. Boom! And get fucked. <laughs> Hello, a yellow door. Oh, noise alarm. Connect that to that. Thank you for falling in. Oh, that's why I got an arrow there. It's Okay, so it's the biggest... Oh, wait, it's a pun. Hmm? What, the agent's name is High Tower. Yeah, and we are in a High Tower. Yep. 
It's only the coming from Eye Tower is the name of the very tall cop from Police Academy. <laughs> okay. The, at least the character's name. I don't know how many movies he has been in. You, you accidentally link me to him once when we try to figure out the actor that makes all the voice uh, uh, a sound effect. I forgot to do it, shut off with him again. But yeah, I think it's over two meters tall. Okay. Like 230 or something. Yeah, this huge. to this door, and then the door, this door to that, so there is a delay, and then opening up. Uh, I had it backwards the previous time. So there, there, and just for good measure, turn off the lights, and call down the elevator. Because why not? Too late. Hmm. Uh, wait, oh, hell. Okay, I, for a moment I thought that with the alarm staying on, that it would uh, keep the door gear, the gate open, but apparently not. So let's try that again. Yeah, I guess it is. I can see why the crusher was so expensive. You're not simply as, as if we saw the breaker down the door. Yeah, <laughs> you're picking it across the freaking room. Yeah, in my words exactly. Or in even one case, you kicked it across the room and through a window. Twice. There we go. Okay. Oh, we are like going high. I suspect you may be killing more people with the doors. <laughs> okay, now... Oh, this guy is now watching, looking the wrong way. The door is open. And we can go down. Okay, so now we can enter through that way. And actually, how do you use the gun? Oh, you never used the gun? <laughs> Pretty much, I think. I, I didn't think of that. Customize keyboard controls. Okay, shift the whole gun. Okay, and we can aim it around actually, but this guy we just knock out. Now we have to dodge these three guys to get to the blue line. Okay, we'll just have to follow them in. And none of these professionals think to check the freaking elevator. <laughs> so much for professionals, huh? Is there a way to close all the doors? We, we could do that now. Um, hmm. Actually, oh, no, we can do that. There we go. He could have seen me there. And these guys are super fast on the draw, so I, could, I just barely miss getting shot there. Welcome by. 
and now... Go, oh, there we go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, Conway is a bit more of a badass than we thought. <laughs> I, I was clicking to punch or shoot there, but <laughs> instead he just. <laughs> I don't even know what to call that. <laughs> what the heck happened? <laughs> yeah. Uh. Did the guy seriously throw you out of the window? Did you just. Punched him to the moon? <laughs> From the looks of it. Uh, hmm. Yeah. I think, I think it was the moment I blinked and missed what the heck happened. Actually, to make sure. Because uh, even though we, <laughs> we probably snapped his spine in half with that, uh, probably best to make sure. <laughs> Okay, but how are we getting in here? Well, ain't it obvious? Oh yeah. Oh, oh hello, smartass. <laughs> he knocked the door on us instead. Uh, great. Auto save oh, 32 oh. seconds. Okay. Damn it, I hope we could just kick him down with the door. Yeah, instead he kicked us down. <laughs> okay then. Oh, look at that, shit hat Conway packs a piece. For your own safety spritz, you want insult the hat? <laughs> <laughs> you know what, fuck this, I've seen your record, I know you shoot. Good boy, now drop it. Fuck you anyways. That's even a lot, why don't you just shoot him? <laughs> okay, he had a hidden switch in here. Or a light switch it's called. Either way, oh, oh we have a timer. Come home! Okay, I guess that means that, uh, yeah, originally I, I incapacitated him. Design code and words with Tom Fred, John Roberts, Fabian from Dummelen, that that's an obvious Dutch name. Music, Ryan I Six dead, ten injured, twenty jobs, thirteen K. The week I couldn't in my mind like an gunshot in an empty street. Like something that happened in the last week. I've had better weeks. They don't let me name names in this blog, but the person behind the hit I was investigating is dead now. Played the dangerous game, but he didn't have the cards. He played the dangerous game, insulting my hat. In fact, I may have killed more people than I actually avenged here. Oops. The trigger man's gone down. Oh, wait, so he's alive? Okay. I thought that would feel good. I was escaping what it cost. I thought that would feel good. It did. That would. Uh, I yeah, felt good if I hadn't taken a seven-story body, <laughs> seven body slam. Uh, I don't know. I think I picked the right side. Sometimes I think I parked the wrong side. I guess I picked the less shitty of two incredibly shitty sides. Maybe that doesn't matter. Maybe all that matters is justice, revenge. Did I not have the ability to kick down to us? <laughs> Either way... <laughs> I think I need 10 cc's of ketamine and a Colombo Marathon. <laughs> uh, publish. It, that actually launched a web... <laughs> Conway's <laughs> secret blog. Uh, Penda <laughs> Act... <laughs> <laughs> oh, that, that, that's close to game. <laughs> uh, okay, sneaky motherfuckers. I'd completely forgotten about that. <laughs> okay, let me pull that away. 
and then let's see can I turn this to capture actually I'll just uh, da -da -da. where is it display capture turn that on and that is still that is still zoomed in from uh, Gex so let me correct that a bit wait you want to uh, play Gex now uh, no back from from the something Sunday I still have the uh, <clears throat> the window screen zoomed in to, to cut out the upper corner and such because it, it would only open up in a teeny tiny window at the top but yeah I think I might as well zoom this in anyways yeah Conway's secret blog not so secret now huh jackass 6 dead 10 <laughs> injured 20 jobs 13k <laughs> Uh, professional spy, amateur electrician, weaponized jerk. <laughs> Specialties, super jumping, rewiring security, property damage, and falling over. <laughs> okay. Uh, what is this? This is one person's custom generated epilogue from Gunpoint, a stealth game about rewiring things and punching people. How is this made? This is a result of how they handled the game key decisions and how uh, glib they chose uh, uh, to be about the end. What do I get? He Where do I get it? Here, it's 10 bucks and there's a free uh, demo. <laughs> okay, I I'm saving this and I'm actually showing that to some people I know. <laughs> uh. Good job. Yeah. And here we was thinking that we were we was to maybe finish this game next week, but no. <laughs> uh, how much time was that actually? That about an hour and a half, a bit short. Uh. <laughs> yeah, we basically have forty minutes. What the heck are uh, we gonna do in forty minutes? Uh, we don't have to fill everything in. We can just have uh, things be s slower for a bit. Yeah, uh, yeah. If if we just if we just keep going with we play one game and if we finish it early we start the next one. Uh, that's going to make things difficult to watch if everything is going to be uh, the finale of the previous one and episode one of the next one. So, yeah. so you yeah. could cut it up, sure, but yeah, I get what you mean. Yeah, if, if I have to run everything through shortcuts, I'll I'll end up forgetting it sooner or later, anyways. Like I've been doing anyway. But at least yeah. I'm at least I'm caught up again on my upload. So from tomorrow on, they should be coming out the day after streaming. Yep. And yeah, sometimes it can be good to end early just to relax. Yeah, it, it doesn't. With Orcs Must Die, it was fun to just do a bit of extra just to see how long we could keep going. But here we just be... Yeah, there are... I believe there are custom-made maps of this by players. Which, uh, apparently only a quarter of the players who have this game shot the jackass. And actually, let's have a little look here through the Steam achievements. Uh, cat burglar get used to drop shot to land suddenly from a great height. <laughs> the picture it, it's gone away with a freaking cat tail. Uh, what? On the QT, use the house cracker to jump through a window silently outside of the test lab. Not really a prank, man. Use the prank spasm to knock someone out who isn't standing near a power socket outside of the test lab. Okay, I don't think we actually got. Oh wait, I think I know how that might work. If you, you if you connect the outlet to something else, that'll probably electrify it. And hello there, General Kenobi. Is sorry, you you we you just missed the ending of the game, so we're just looking over the Steam achievements here. <laughs> General Kenobi. I yeah. think you know who that is. I'm uh, gonna I'm gonna boop the news. I'm gonna boop the news. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Crossfire. Use the long shot to make a uh, guard unintentionally shoot another. Trip, uh, title after, uh, finally relevant. F help justify my early to not entirely wise choice of a game name by holding someone at gunpoint with the resolver. <laughs> Breaking and entering. Use the gate crashes to kick a door off its hinges and into some uh, professional jackass's skull. 
Which is exactly the next one. Low flying doors. Use the gate crashes to kick a door into a guard. <laughs> Might as well have an achievement for that too. Use the gate crashes to kick a door through a window. <laughs> uh, Warhammer Vermintide 2. Yeah, Rene, I have that game, but I've, I've only played a little of it with a friend who isn't around too much, but... Hmm. Would that be actually be a good game to stream? Maybe. Uh, I actually thought about it today. I'm wondering, would that be good to stream with Helium and play with him? Hmm. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, yeah, let's put that on for eventually. If yeah, uh, I know we spoke about it in the past, but then I had an older computer that maybe could not handle it. But this computer might be able to handle it. Okay. Uh, yeah, we could do that next week then. We we have some other games that we have ready for Saturday side shows like this, and that was me dropping the pincers I typically use to just be obno a bit obnoxious with, and that was me dropping them again down. Uh, yeah, sometimes I get a bit neurotic and need to fiddle with something. Uh, Anyways, continuing on. Open door policy. <laughs> Knock a guard out by opening a door into him. <laughs> <laughs> and next up, so this is why people don't like me. Get knocked down by an opening door. <laughs> uh, let's see. I'll aim when I'm dead. Upgrade your bullfrog hyper trousers to pounce instantly. <laughs> I may be some time. Upgrade your bullfrog hybrid houses to maximum jump strength. I taste battery acid. <laughs> Upgrade your battery capacity to the non-figurative max. <laughs> and the picture yeah. is just Conway glowing like a fucking radioactive blue <laughs> lava lamp. <laughs> uh. Ding. Wire an elevator to trigger something with when the elevator arrives. Short circuit. Use the crosslink to create an infinite loop that burns itself out. I forget actually what that you know, what uh, that does. Can you describe what it does? <laughs> uh, ghost. Leave no living witnesses to your presence on a mission that has guards. Gentleman. Use no violence at all on a mission that has guards. Perfect gentleman. Complete a mission that has guards. With no violence, witnesses, or loud noises. Case closed. Complete the game. Case filed. Publish your personalized epilogue. Rogue, sympathi uh, Rogue sympathizer. Steal Gessler's technology for Rook. Cover up. Conceal your presence at the data sec breaking from Mayfield. Uh, I think that might have been the one that I was talking about earlier. Clean record. Complete the police chief's mission without incriminating yourself. Could have been that one as well. Payback. Catch a guilty man at the expense of freeing an innocent one. Uh, that would be... Would that be the, uh, the truth one? Or actually I can look it up here. What the uh, requirements Maybe. for these achievements are. Gunpoint achievements. And it says there's secret achievements. Nine hidden secret achievements. Okay. What? Okay, let's see. Control F, pay back, catch a guilt in the attack, choose and complete the, the mission, rook the killer, uh, then complete the game, ensuring you defeat the killer waiting outside guilt. So, okay. At the expense of freeing an innocent one. Oh, it, I. Instead of freeing an innocent man, we caught uh, a guilty man. That is what it means. I was just misunderstanding for a moment. Knuckle down, knock Fritz Gessler out with you know, a punch. Why don't you just shoot him? Shoot Fritz Gritler. Not worth the bullet. Intimidate Fritz Gessler into surrendering. Okay. I'm guessing that I must have done that on my previous playthrough as well. And uh, let's get OBS up front again. It's okay. Achievements I haven't gotten. Mission architect. Create a custom mission. 
Necessary force, jump into an enforcer to knock him through a window. Okay. I am better at this than Tom Francis. Complete a mission faster than I can. <laughs> okay. That's that's always just fun when they put in their own little uh, uh, speed records and such. Hammerhead Shark. Mock the police chief at a critical moment. Uh, where is that one in here? Hammerhead Shark goes through the indicated mission without being seen on any cameras. This is odd since cameras don't do crap otherwise except uh, act, uh, as, act as switches, but that'll do. Uh, da, da, da. Let Mayfield discover your involvement, then during your final conversation with the police chief, mission Mayfield in the room. Choose either, I hope you have a good morgue, and I've been there, you don't, or shouldn't you be hoping I have a bad one? Okay, that must have been from... Uh, <clears throat> Good. That must have been from uh, chat options that we didn't pick. Uh, let it go. Free an innocent man at the expense of catching a guilty one, which is basically go for the truth. Uh, General Kenobi, hey, I was wondering why Hillian sounded so familiar. You're from Guild Wars 2, aren't you? Uh, yeah, I <laughs> we play. <clears throat> uh, I used to play with uh, yeah Drakir here and others in. Where Wanderlust was it? I, I think that it activity in, has in, been dropped down a lot with in, that. In the several games, even. Okay. Let's see. And I think you, I think you met the, this this person. I, I'll tell you more about them later. Yeah, not to dox them. And the final exactly. one that's seen here acknowledged. In, an acknowledged ludo narrative dissonance. Notice the story doesn't uh, exactly gel with the mechanics. Become qualified James games journalist. The hell? What? Uh, after beating the game, when updating your blog, choose the third option each time. <laughs> okay. And what are these hidden achievements? Uh, wait. Open ended guards, take your final enemy out in each of uh, eight known ways. Achievement removed. Okay, so the, that must have been an. Uh, yeah, it's been removed, so the game must have been updated since then. Secret achievements. Coming clean. Voluntarily tell Katie the truth. Okay. Uh, almost honest. Chicken out of telling Katie the truth at the last minute, which is. Okay, at the same point, but different in Intact sympathizer, tell Gessler that Rox hired you to betray him. Uh, uh, Rox sympathizer, we already have that one. Cover up, let it go. And wait, what are the other secret or hidden achievements then? Uh, okay, odd. Uh, oh, those, those might be connected to the DLC packs. Um, it has DLC? Yeah, small bits, I think. Uh, I, I'll I'll look into those, but for now we have gone on long enough with this. That was just like 10, sec uh, 10 minutes of talking about that. Uh, General Kenobi again, what maps do you have back there, by the way? Uh, what maps you mean, or what sort? Uh, I have no uh, custom maps of this game installed, if that's what you mean. Oh dear. No, I mean behind you, IRL. Oh, those. Uh, those are Prophets of Cyrodiil and the Shivering Owls from uh, Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion. And next to that is a, well, it says it on it, it's a poster from Time Shift. And XCOM Enemy Unknown, another poster. <laughs> yeah, it's going like that. Hillian has a smaller room than me, but tons of poster. I have a bigger room than him, but and zero posters. And I still have some that I need to... Where the hell did I put those? The, uh, there I put those. I still have more posters. <laughs> 
Uh, this one's a Mario one. It's they're both still rolled up. And the uh, heck was this one again? And rolling it over to try and see it. I think this is just a generic dragon coaster. But yep. yeah, I don't really have room to put that uh, with the consoles on the wall and such. Yeah, just ahead of people. At the moment, I can't see what he is showing you all. Okay, General Kenobi again. Elder Scrolls, nice. I was thinking they might uh, be from. I just have Star Wars posters myself. Nothing wrong with that. Uh, but yeah, this isn't a show off your you know, room you know, thing. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> Anything else to say uh, from you, Drakir? Not a good thing, that was a hilarious game. <laughs> and there was the posters falling over. Oh. Uh, yeah, this this is a little masterpiece. <laughs> uh, and for just nine bucks, uh, basically, I'd say anyone anyone should at least give this a try, since well, there's a demo. So, yeah, if if you know someone who hasn't played this game or its demo, just point them towards it, and I I think they'll enjoy their time with it. Yeah, especially if they enjoy. Uh, would you classify it as a jumping puzzle? Not really. There, there's a lot of jumping and you need to jump to get around. <laughs> yeah, you have some puzzle elements, but... Yeah, it, yeah. It's not It's not like hardcore or anything. It's, it's a pretty easy, like medium difficulty at worst. But overall, it's just, it just does a few little things and it does them really well. That is something yeah. that a lot of games can't say. That they try a lot of things, they do some goods, they suck at some others, and maybe one or two they do really well, but generally they don't. Yeah, they bite off more than they can chew, pretty much. Yeah, <laughs> there's plenty of those. Uh, but yeah. Uh, this has been Gunpoint. Thank you all for watching. Now later on on YouTube. And thank you, General Kenobi, for watching. And as always, special thanks to you, Dick here. Oh, you're most welcome, lad. Uh, yeah, tomorrow I have some extra games you know, stored up already. Um, but as always, until next time. But until then, until then. Be safe, folks. Oh, come on.